friends and family of Christy and Chris, what a joy it is to welcome you all here. We have come to here to celebrate the miracle of love and to witness, witness the marriage of Christopher Reed Stickle and Christy Lee Lemon. Every experience you have had, everything you have ever done, everything you have ever learned has brought you to this moment. As you now stand before these witnesses to take each other as husband and wife, new experiences lie before you with the opportunities to grow deeper in love with each other. Who gives Christy to be married to Chris? Mother and I. Today is the beginning of a new life together for you. It marks the commencement of a new relationship and life's greatest moments. As they give recognition to the worth and beauty of your love and add their best wishes to the words that shall unite, shall unite you today as husband and wife. God knew your needs when he brought you two together and he knew exactly what you needed to make you complete. Now he wants you to commit yourselves and accept each other as one. He has chosen to complete you. As you walk hand in hand into the future, cherish each moment as a gift, a gift given to strengthen the bond between you. At this time, Jenny Knott, a family friend, will read a poem, The Art of a Good Marriage. A good, a good marriage must be created. In marriage, little things are the big things. It is never being too old to say, to hold hands. It is remembering to say I love you at least once a day. It is never going to sleep angry. It is having a mutual sense of values and common objectives. It is standing together and facing the world. It is forming a circle that gathers the whole family. And it is speaking words of appreciation and demonstrating gratitude in different and thoughtful ways. It is having the pecanic. Capacity to forgive and forget, and is giving each other an atmosphere in which she can grow. It is a common search for the good and beautiful, and it is not only marrying the right person, it is being the right partner. Chris, please repeat after me. Hi, Christy. Hi, Chris. Take you, Christy. To be my wife. To be my wife. My partner in life. cherish our friendship and love you today, tomorrow, and forever. I will trust you and I will honor you. I will love you faithfully through the best and the worst, through the difficult and the easy. What may come, I will always be there. Because I have given you my hand to hold. So I give you my life to keep. You are about to give each other a ring. The wedding ring is a symbol of many things. It is made in a perfect circle that symbolizes a love that is permanent and everlasting. There are two rings because there are two people, each to make a contribution to the life of the other and to their new life together. Whenever you look at this ring, may it, ever, may it forever remind you of the promises you have made this day to keep your love pure, priceless, and permanent.
Christy, I give you this ring. Wear it with love and joy. As this ring has no end, neither shall my love for you. I choose you to be my wife and stay in forever. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I give you this ring and as a token of my love and devotion with all my heart I pledge you all that I am with this ring I marry you and join my life to yours <coughs> maybe <laughs> here we go Christy and Chris have chosen to affirm their love by the lighting of a unity camp in doing so, they signal their desire to not only join as one, but to unite two families together as one. Chrissy and Chris, you have expressed your love to one another through the commitment and promises you have just made. It is with these in mind that I pronounce you husband and wife. Chris, you may kiss your bride. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my honor to introduce to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Chris Stickle.